Hello, welcome to Paul's Take. This is a 2013 Jeep Wrangler Sport two-door. This is the type of vehicle I like. That to me is the size of a Jeep. Two doors, not four doors, two doors. This one here has some mods to it, different headlights. I think this is different too, which is nice. That's a Jeep. Small, light, agile, tight places, tight turns. Not practical whatsoever. This one's got some pretty fancy wheels on here. Let's see what size it is. Looks like about 20s to me. 275, 55 on a 20. More show than go, but not too bad. No truck space. Especially with the seats up. If you fold it down, you might have a little bit for a two person vehicle. This one has the uh, hard doors, soft top, red accents. I'm not sure if that's the way it came or not. Like I said, this is a used vehicle. It has power door locks, just neat, cloth seats, as a Jeep should, it should have cloth seats, 63,000 miles on it, steering wheel all tore up, let's see, yeah, radio, just like mine and my Liberty, exactly the same, and windows over here in the center. The uh, air conditioner is exactly the same. Simple. I like these. I like these kind of AC units where it's just on or off. AC. And where's it coming from? No, uh, no different modes to press. No kind of weird kind of menu settings. It's got the OG handle. Uh, Two-wheel drive to four-wheel drive. Four-wheel drive high. And four-wheel drive low, automatic. It's got a little, little cubby for your stuff. Your, oh my goodness, handles. Jeep, since 1941. Little speakers up top, probably have a good sound system. Your speakers up top there, uh, yeah. Speakers up top on the roll bar. Let's see how easy it is to get to the back. Oh, let's see this forward. And climb in here. Well, if you're an athlete like myself, not too bad. Hey, actually, not too much, not too bad uh, leg room. I thought it'd be worse. It's not too bad. Pretty comfortable. All right, there you have it. Not too bad, not too bad. So we try it out, try it out, see how it looks. Imagine the doors are off. Very cool. Let's find out the price. So I checked the website and they're asking $26,000 for this 2013 Wrangler. I think it's overpriced. I can see maybe 18 or 19,000. But Jeeps do hold their value, but also you can buy a brand new one for about 30. So that's brand new with factory warranty and factory newness and all fresh smell. So that would be my route. Unless they were asking about 18, I would entertain that. But 26, not for me. Thanks for watching Paul's Take, and that's my take on this 2013 Jeep Wrangler Sport.